There's actually what we're doing. We got a uh, little bit of garlic salt, some steak and chop from Weber, the blend from Kinder's, buttered steak from Kinder's, onion powder, onion garlic powder, some slap your daddy barbecue beef, and some black pepper. First I mustard it, then I fill it. You guys can watch. Nice generous amount. Rub it in, that's why it's called a rub, I guess. Don't forget to get the sides. Oh, gotta stay open. There you go. And then we'll do that side here. You're flipped up there. Get that in there. I'll go to this side here. Alright, now we're gonna go with a little bit of garlic. Manually garlic, relish garlic. And this is a 16 pound brisket. Onion granulate, there we go, a little bit of that on there. Make sure we got the sides. Put this on the side. And we gotta do the other side here in a minute too. So, then we're gonna go with this, uh, it's a butter steak. Tastes pretty good, so I'll try to add a little bit of that on there. On the side there and there. I like the old blended salt, pepper, garlic, basically, but it kind of covers everything too. So I don't know. I put the kitchen sink on stuff, and people seem seem to like it. And then let's take a little bit of that. Last little bit of garlic salt. You don't want to go too heavy on salt, because well, you can do a little bit, but I never put too much on it. I am a salty dog, though. Arr, arr, arr. Anyway. Okay, and now for some black pepper. All right, now I'm gonna flip it over. This is where I left a little quarter inch of the fat on it. A little mustard here. Get that all spread in there. Good to go. There you go. Mustard kind of acts as a bonder, I guess. But usually, meat, I think spices stick to it all the time anyway. But you know, I'm not a cooking show. Well, I don't know anything. I'm not trained. Just know I'm kind of a moron sometimes, so that's good for me. Anyway, okay, back same thing. We're gonna do the same process, same stuff. A little generous of this bad slap your daddy barbecue seasoning. Sides are important. Ends are important as well. Because I don't get it all, you guys can hate me, I guess. I need to still put garlic powder. Sides. And this end. And I'll go a little faster than usual because I'm trying to beat someone picking up someone from the airport and walking in. So if I can get her done before then, I'll garlic salt. Don't be a hater. And then I gotta come over here. That's the rubber. Shake that. Got that in. There we go. And then we're gonna go with the garlic salt. One, garlic, salt, pepper, that's good there. And we got a little bit of butter. The vice versa, I think. I think I'm gonna miss any sides. I'll make sure I get the sides with all that good stuff there. There, I think we got it pretty good. The sides are there, put it down here. Gotta soak it up there. All right, so now I'm gonna throw this on a little cling wrap wrap because I'm going to start smoking this about 3 a.m. this morning in the morning so here in about uh, uh, six seven eight hours so it'll, it'll rest for about eight hours I'm gonna get another thing, thing on there just to kind of seal it up let's hopefully uh, do some good uh, marinade is kind of a liquid thing I think but anyway that's the whole point we're seasoning it pretty seasoning I don't think you can be too lenient on. I don't think you see, everybody likes seasoning, so the more the merrier, I think. But then again, what do I know? All right, so now that I got it all packed up, and I'm gonna wrap it with some Reynolds wrap, a little tin foil. Get that out. Now, tell you so long, it's so big, I'm gonna put it on top there. I'm gonna take this off now. 
I'm going to flip it over. Put it in there. So, there we go. Put that in. That in there. Put that up. Put this up. I'm going to put another one. Put it on this way. Just trying to seal it as airtight as you can get it so that for the next seven hours it'll and actually probably six and a half because I'll take it out about a half hour to four so it'll rest to room temperature before I put it in on the smoker which uh, we'll talk about that here in the next piece of this down here put that in there So there we go, I got that done. I'm sweating, good thing I didn't get anything in a, well, add salt to it, I guess. <laughs> anyway, there you go.